Messer Da Vinci! Yes? Buongiorno e ben arrivato. Hai malvise. Signor Don has asked to escort you to the workshop. Are you ready? Ah, Venezia! What other place is as beautiful, as stable, as birth? Come, I will show you her wonders. Our first stop, the Rialto Bridge. Behold the elegance with which she spans the Grand Canal, a symbol of Venetian unity and pride. Let us continue. Here we are, San Giacomo di Rialto. Oldest church in Venezia. Isn't she beautiful? And her clock tower. Magnifico! Let come, come. Know. There's more to a see. A handsome reward is on offer for any thing about the demise of the assassino. No other city can match the size of Venezia's markets. Be it spices or silk, from near and far. There is... There is... You were told to stay home, but the rent is paid. I have every right to sell here. Emilio disagrees. No, no, stop, stop. Let us continue the tour elsewhere. Amazing. Would you mind buying it for me? I have I left my money with my bags. Hey! Mind your step, Corleone! Here we have the Palazzo della Seta, home to Emilio Barbarigo. Normally I'd suggest a closer look, but with the way things are now... Why? What's happened? He is attempting to unify the merchants beneath a single banner. There's been resistance. Some of it violent. What kind of resistance? They say they're fighting for the people, for freedom or some such nonsense. But Giannate, if you ask me. They destroyed my stand. I demand compensation. Here you are, then. The Doge will know about this. I'll report you to the Council. Good luck with that, my friend. What are you doing? You're under arrest for disrupting commerce. What? You just invented that. There's no such law. There is now. No, stop! present to you your workshop, Ser Da Vinci. We spared no expense in its design. You'll see, it is perfect, as if you never left Firenze. I wish you great success, and hope you enjoy Venezia as much as she enjoys having you. So, here we are. Exciting, isn't it? Here to come in? It may be later. I need to visit the Palazzo della Seta. Try and gain an audience with Emilio. As you wish. But should you find yourself with free time, or another Codex page, don't hesitate to visit. My door is always open. Grazie, my friend.
di nulla. Leonardo! Ezio, so good to see you. How can I help you? Haha! <laughs> you found another one! How exciting! If you transpose this word and move this line to the left, it's deciphered. Emilio Barbarigo, Titan of Venetian industry, terror of the underworld. Aided by his powerful family, he cornered the market through smart business practices such as edging out the competition and lobbying the government. He funded the Venetian police force almost single-handedly, keeping the streets safe from crime and his finances tax-free. Emilio claims to be a supporter of the Republic. The problem is, once you own the police force, voting becomes, well, inefficient. As does, you know, opposition. How best to get inside? Scale the wall and... Oh, that's not good. I'll never make that jump. Need to find another way. Remember you. We need to go. You never did apologize for knocking me over. No. Va bene, where to? The water. That doesn't exactly narrow it down. <gasps> Better off 
off on my own. Come any closer and I'll cut you to pieces. <laughs> What's your name? Rosa. Honorato Rosa. I'm Ezio. I know. What do you mean, I know? No, no, Ora. Now is not the time for small talk. Are you blind? Ezio, what are you doing? Come here! Yes. Oh, I thought you flogged for that, but I have to find a guardsman who actually cares. I want no part of you! You weren't planning on leaving me here. Oh, that is interesting. The rest. Hey! Hey! Don't forget about me! I've done other things through and paid the price, but not this. Mercy! Has been wounded. Pass out here. We'll go the rest of the way in the boat. Yeah. Careful. Go! I'll deal with the guards. Get down, Tronto! There! You will not get away! Yo, quickly! You want this?
Merda, bring him. They're shooting at us. Idiota! Say a prayer later! Porco I need to see... I need to see Antonio! Be careful! Let me do it! Go and find Antonio! Mr. Hugo, do what he says! Qual'ultimo arrivato dagli ordini! Hey! Hey! Wake up! We need help. Where's Antonio? Make yourselves useful. Clear a space for her. Put her down there. Where are we? Oh, they've sent for help. Thank you. Rosa, what's happened? Just get this out of me. Soon, soon. Let's have a look first. Clean entry and exit through the thigh. That's good. Get it out! Rosa, we must take care not to... Now! Come here, boy. Tenetela! I'm sorry, piccola. Sorry! Ficcatelo nel culo, you sorry! Go fetch Bianca and be quick. Help me with this. How? Take a clean piece of linen. When I remove my hand, press the cloth into her room. Are you ready? Now! Uh, ben uh, Fanto, you work well under pressure. Uh, She's spirited this one. Porca putana! Avanti! Get Rosa inside so that Bianca can close the wound. You'll be all right. The worst is past. Venisi cancero, brutto bastardo! A te e a quella grandissima troia di tua madre! Thank you. 
Rosa is most dear to me. If I had lost her... I've always had a soft spot for women in distress. So I've heard. Don't look so surprised. We know all about you, Ser Ezio. Your work in Florence and the rest of Tuscany. Good work, too. If a little... unrefined. Then you know why I'm in Venezia. I can guess. When you have a minute, come see me in my office. There's something we should discuss. Prego. Can I offer you something? Biscotti. Un café. What's café? An interesting concoction brought to me by a Turk merchant. Here. Have a taste. A little bitter, if you ask me. It just seems lacking somehow. I don't know. Have you considered adding sugar, maybe? Or latte? I suppose it's something of an acquired taste. Enough about that. Now where were we? Our failure at the Palazzo cost us dearly. It will take time to recover. No doubt Emilio will use this pause to strengthen his defenses. And continue his oppression of the district. You may not share our motive, but I know you share our goal. Why not gather your forces and try again? To act in haste would only bring more losses. No. We must resupply and draw new plans. Can ill afford to sit around and wait? Nor would I want you to. Work with us instead. Already my men begin to mend today's wounds. Seek them out. They'll put you to work. The sooner you aid them, the sooner we can strike. Molto bene, Messere. I accept. It is the right decision. 